today and I'm gonna wake Morgan up. Margo. It's a beautiful day to be happy. Oh my God, that bed head. What are you doing? I'm starting the vlog. Yeah, we're having a sister day. Hi, you guys. It's already 1.30, what? Em woke me up and I got ready and we got ready and we did all this situation and now we're on our way to our nail appointment. Beyonce is trying to creep up in the like, sorry, not sorry, you know. Um, yeah, we're gonna go to our, get our nails done today and um, this vlog is for Tony, Ashley, and, um, and Jasmine because Y'all said you wanted us to vlog today when we were doing Periscope yesterday. So, we're doing just that. We're gonna hopefully go try on some clothes and get some food or something. And yeah, so that's what we're doing today. We're gonna go because we're running late, but guess what, Em? Very late, what? Just because, so we wouldn't run late. I lied to you and I told you it was at three, but it's really at four. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> Aren't you happy though? No. I know her tricks too well, Morgan. fellas. Fellas. So annoying. Um, we just got to Navy's and it's it's basically like a pro store. I go here to get all my stuff because I get my pro discount, which is like 40% off, which Em was just saying, like, that is so helpful. <laughs> we get that discount. Um, so we're gonna go in and stock up on some shiz and do that. If you guys are ever in North Hollywood though, I definitely recommend going just because it's kind of a like beauty heaven if you're into makeup or hair or Whatever it may be, skincare, they've got everything. We look like sisters. Cause we're both wearing makeup actually. We're gonna ask me to vlog. Hey, 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 hey. So I'm an <laughs> asshole. <laughs> I even brought my camera with me into Namie's. Yeah, there we go. Oh my God, I need to like, no. Um, guys, side note, these glasses, I call them my sassy goggles. And Em always makes fun of me, and I was feeling sassy today, so I figured I would wear them. Um, anyway, we didn't film at all in Namie's. I hate myself, right? Right? Anyway, we just got, what did we get, Em? Come on. <laughs> we got Jamba. What's new? I love um, this area in North Hollywood, though. Like, where would you say that we are? We're, like, close to Sherman Oaks. Yeah. What's up, bitches? We're back. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're we just got to lack. Um, but I forgot to say that it's their stop. I put my lip gloss on. Um, we're at their new location for the first time. They literally moved like overnight. Uh, to bring my lipstick with me. Oh no, that doesn't look good. Ew, look. Ew, that doesn't. That looks so bad. Morning, it looks milky. It literally looks like you got like thick old milk and put it on your lips. Ew. Yeah. Oh, don't put on more. Oh. This, okay, we're gonna go in and I will see if we can film a little bit. Ew. I get a apples and greens with protein and daily vitamin. Mega mango without fresh orange juice and it's gross. Don't recommend. <laughs> New location. Hmm? These are the colors we're getting. Let's see. Okay, what's this called again? Merino Cool. Merino Cool, and she's getting basic because she's doing, remember, she's doing the. Box and Eyewitness News. I and Eyewitness like, News. Is that the show, do you think? Eyewitness News? Yeah, it'll just be like a session. Oh wait, show your nails. I got super, super basic this time and I went round and M did, like literally, I think she gets that every time. But so we realized, oh, the mall closes at seven and we're an hour away. What'd we do? We are taste testing, what's it called? Mac and Cheetos and chicken fries. <laughs> are you kidding me? And I got an Oreo shake. And I feel that really is bad what about you it. Do. Wait, which ones are these? These are the Mac and Cheetos. Honestly, who created that? Because that sounds disgusting. Really, does it, Emily? <laughs> Oh, literally, oh my god, smell that right now. I mean, it kind of just smells like obesity, like but like... Is there, like, sauce? Not for these, no. I Cheers. Don't. Cheers. Should 
it's not what I expected. Don't lie. That's freaking Honestly, awesome. Honestly, I was kind of expecting. <laughs> wow. That's what the inside looks like. Um, it's would I get it again? No, because goals, but, <laughs> but if I was like, didn't have to worry about that type of shit, and if it didn't actually contain like cancer as an ingredient. We'll update you on how we feel in about an hour. <laughs> yeah, I know. We don't eat fast food ever now. Like ever, probably for uh, for about a year, or at least. Yeah. All right, here's your chicken fry. Do you want zesty ranch or honey mustard? Ranch. I know, right? Why would you even get honey mustard? I just asked for it to have options. This okay, is guys. So bad. This is a chicken fry. <laughs> What's zesty? Wait, I have a hair in my mouth. <laughs> okay. Wait. Oh my god, it's chicken. <laughs> it's like a chicken nugget. That's good. I, hate I think we should meat. Shut up. I know. I have to <laughs> eat meat now. Okay, now we're gonna try the honey mustard. Just for shits and gigs. And I realized that this entire vlog has been in the car. And I oh I just realized also, I was telling them, it's okay, I know what we're gonna do, and I still haven't told her yet. Target doesn't close till eleven, so we're going to Target and we're gonna try on clothes in the Target dressing room and we're just gonna get a cart full of clothes. We're trying on them all because you guys wanted to see that. That was a specific request. They want us to try on clothes in a store, and since Target's the only store that we Yo, can do that in. What's going on? There's like a helicopter flying really low, circling someplace. Stop! This world's such a shitty place to be. Like I don't even want to know what that is. Honey Wait, honey mustard. Someone. Ignore. Honey mustard. Did you eat that fry, bitch? <laughs> okay. So. You had some. I'm still. I'm still eating though. <laughs> <laughs> guys, we're parked at an intersection. The, the Burger King's right behind us, and there's just an intersection with- I don't like that. You know what, I totally do. Me and Morgan used That's to do good. this when we were heavier. I mean, get fast food every day. Oh, you guys, we would get, like, breakfast in the mornings was McDonald's breakfast every day. I would get two, I think it was actually a number two. I can't remember what number it was, the combo, but it was two breakfast sandwiches with egg and sausage. Sausage egg and sausage egg McMuffin, I think, with um, a hash brown and um, and an orange, a large orange juice. Make sure you order the large. <laughs> and also, I would get that um, the cinnamon rolls, and I would literally eat all of that for breakfast. What would yeah. you? What did and you then get? Then we go to Taco Bell for lunch. Yeah. Get like six quesadillas. Oh my God, those quesadillas with the Baja Blast. Baja Blast freeze. We used to get that. It's not uh. that bad anymore. <laughs> No, it really my body, my I like how our bodies like can't take it. Like we <laughs> just like can't. I'm gonna eat the rest of my <laughs> mac and Cheeto. I have like, see that's just a weird combination. Mac and cheese and Cheetos. I think it works. Okay, we will see you in the Target dressing room. Okay, wait, um, yeah. let's see what you have on. It's only be cute if you're pregnant. That's really cute. I don't like the back. What's the back? It like splits. Oh, weird. Hold on. Em, I'm having a bad try on day. This is where the tummy tuck is going to come in handy. So much skin is just... Ugh. All right, so I think this would be like hella freaking cute with Spanx and like these black heels that I have. But in this light and without Spanx, I look actually pregnant. You can see my belly button and everything. Spanx do wonders, guys. You will see this on Instagram and it won't even look like the same dress. Makes my boobs look good, though. It's all about the good. Good boobage. Am I right, ladies? My right, ladies? Okay, show me what you're getting. So, hashtag call time. Hashtag no. We each are only getting like one thing. 
because we had a bad shopping and trip. And we're gonna have an emotional talk about it in the car. <laughs> I'm getting this I That's cute. Jeans. <laughs> because neither of us wanted to leave with anything, so we got some ugly. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I feel cute as shit in this though, even with this belly. Oh, that's. You're gonna get it? No. I think you should. I wanna wear it. Well, with my cream cardigan and jeans, it'd be hella cute, but. I don't know. So, the thing is, you think that like you just lose weight and stuff and like, I mean I thought, like I was like, I'm gonna lose weight walking to a store and anything that I thought was cute on the rack would look good on me. But, like that's so not true. I mean you guys saw even the dress that I got, which is hella cute, like it looks ridiculous without Spanx. But I know like I'm gonna put on some Spanx at home and I'm gonna look snatched to the gods, right? But like everything else that I tried on, I was just not feeling it and like she wasn't really feeling very much either. I hate shopping. I kind of wanted to talk about though like the whole, like I was just saying, people like always say like relationship goals like between me, like sister goals, you know, best friend goals, or like when we post our transformation pictures and stuff. And like what you guys may like see but that you probably don't know like the details of is that me and Em, like I would say. <laughs> We're not friends. No, but really like growing up obese. Um, is it completely robbed, at least I would say me, of the confidence to like go and initiate friendships and maintain them. That's the other thing though, we've jumped around our whole lives like except for at the really small private school that we were extremely sheltered in from preschool to eighth grade. And like after that, I just, I don't know, like I was so, it, nothing in me, when we would move to a new school, like I think for both of us, neither of us would feel like really even like like the people we were leaving at that school would want to maintain friendships if we weren't like seeing yeah. them every day and going to school every day and stuff so we definitely like clung to each other and it's funny because we like people see our relationship and stuff and we seem like we're really close which I think that we are right I mean yeah we're pretty close I mean for us it's all that we know yeah <laughs> but Definitely. But like the thing is, like that I was gonna say is that me and Em, like we fight like <gasps> we fight, we fight like, crazy. like a married couple that should be divorced. <laughs> and we know each other so well that we know how to like go in for the kill, man. No, like we we literally do get in like bitch fights though. <laughs> but and it's not it's not like other people's fault. It's literally just how we felt about ourselves. Yeah, that caused us to kind of go off on in our own little corner and kind of stay separated. We never were fully involved in a group because we felt too vulnerable to yeah. open up. And like my mom was asking me about this the other day actually and what I was saying is that like she was like well were you um, like ever I was never really bullied and she was like well what did you think you know because when you ask someone who's insecure um, like what they're afraid of it's usually of being judged. And so she was like, well, were you afraid that people, like when you would walk into a room, that people would judge you? And I said, no, I, I actually wasn't because I felt invisible. What I was afraid of was like how mean I would be to myself in my own head, you know? Mm -hmm. Like the bullshit that I put myself through, like verbally, just like that self-talk, that negative affirmation was like, it beats you up. It's like, like emotional. See, I did like that same thing, but I would, put words in other people's mouths in like in my head like I would say oh I know exactly what they're thinking they're thinking like holy shit look at how big her legs are yeah or, like look at just stupid stuff like that right like why I post pictures and stuff of me with my stretch marks and me with my loose skin and me being a bigger girl because like I don't know I just feel like if we would have seen that stuff in high school and like when we were younger we actually earlier than high school like like been like raised grade. no like been raised yeah. though to when I, I started getting stretch marks I had big boobs in I started wearing a bra like in second grade so like five years before all the other girls did you know like being able I mean of course we weren't like on Instagram then and stuff yeah. but if I would have seen models in a store or something like that that looked any like more like I did or seen people like saying that you know that that's okay that people look like that too like, I feel like that would have at least helped me feel okay, you know? Yeah, I feel like nowadays it's a lot easier to find someone to look up to that's realistic because social media is such a big platform and there's so many, there's all types of people. And yeah. when we were younger and there, like, social media didn't even exist, 
we would go into a store and you'd see a picture of a model and that's all we knew or magazines all yeah the movie stars and stuff like that it was all we knew that's not real life you know like I want like reality to actually be shown like you know you don't just walk yeah. into a store and try and just like pick things off the rack and grab whatever you want you know and sometimes you don't have all the money to do that dude I've got like right now I just spent all my money on my nails <laughs> like, bucks was that account. smart no okay but like not everyone is so like privileged and I think that like people need to freaking know that it's not normal to have everything perfect yeah well, it's not easy when I go on in my bra and underwear and post a picture on Instagram of my like body and how it looks after I put in so much work to lose 100 pounds and it's still not how I want it to be you know but I think that it's so important that like importance of it and the the response and everything mm -hmm. is so much bigger than like oh like I feel embarrassed or I feel vulnerable and I think that like being vulnerable has been such a huge like thing for me in like oh, yeah. gaining my confidence and stuff because I wouldn't have had weight loss surgery I wouldn't have had the confidence to um, put time and effort into my health if I hadn't like grown the love for myself first and honestly such a big part of that was seeing other girls love themselves via the internet yeah. which is I truly believe we would have been so much lower than we were at our yeah. lowest <laughs> like we would have been we still so probably would have been unhappy. Unhealthy, unhappy, probably really sick, honestly. Yeah. Hopefully you guys know that, you know, this isn't like, I don't know, not every day is perfect. And on that note, <laughs> we, oh, I'm gonna sign off. Hmm. Did, Did you, you thought? thought? <laughs> We're just kidding, it's not ending. We, we decided. decided to go to Target. Love you too. Um, I need to get new bedding because I'm redoing my room. And let me walk in. Okay, hold on. Let me just turn on some good romantic music while you walk in too. Look, yeah. Instead yeah, of your trash, like you don't you know I'm filming. Private. That's funny. Wait, that's a good um. Private, but it's see through. What's that called? That's a pun. Wait, mom, you're on the vlog. Say hi. Ass fat. Yeah, no. <laughs> and I. What do I need here? Come on. Let's get this. Which one is it? I'm getting a desk. <laughs> These are cute. You should get a bar cart. Oh my god. Oh wait, I like this chair too. I need an apartment. Target problems. <laughs> Gets everything. Buys a house. <laughs> like literally. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, it's oh so my god. Oh my god. It's gotta go under okay. it. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. So, help, help. Honey? <laughs> it's not gonna fit. It's not gonna fit. It's not gonna fit. It's just 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 we're about to put Load all this bitch stuff up. away. Oh my god. I'm not even kidding you. I matched with that guy on Tinder. Morgan, I'm not even kidding you. You swiped right on that guy with a bleached half of a head of hair. You swiped right on that? Okay, don't you guys think that she should do weekly vlogs, just vlog throughout the week, like little clips, and then, you know, plus other videos, but that's just like an easy way to vlog. And then you have So to, upload like, like one weekly vlog? Yeah. Of clips of the whole week? Yeah, like on every Sunday or Monday or something like that, or Saturday, whatever day, pick a day, and then you'll vlog throughout the week, just random things if you're doing fun that day, or if you're not doing anything, don't vlog. But Let me know if you guys would want to see that, or if it would just be like too random and Jim, jimble jumble jumble jumble. I think it's cute because I like watching videos like that. Okay, well let me know what kind of videos you want to see. Sign up. Just that. sign up. Oh my god. It's nice to know you. Nice. <laughs>